to a new vlog welcome to a new vlog i know i'm excited i don't know why i don't i don't know why but i'm, but I'm excited i'm testing out this perfume oil and this perfume smells so similar to one that i'm trying or one that i've used i think it's la vie belle lancome la vie belle yeah it should be anyway hi guys welcome back to my channel and welcome to a new vlog today is first of april i'm so excited for this new month why i don't know i pray april brings everybody blessings lots of blessings cha. with the way i have time in my hands i don't know if this is going to be like a month a monthly vlog like i don't know if this vlog is going to be for the whole of april because i have a lot of time in my hands as of now as of the time i'm filming this video i can't predict the future but then most of my vlogs have been like monthly monthly just putting the whole month together because i just got back two days ago i'm currently at home home alone my sister gave birth so i was in just for a whole month so thank you guys to the number of people that have reached out to me do you know i didn't even expect anybody to reach out to me when this whole kajuna abuja train thing happened um Thank God, for now, it's only the train that is affected. That's the train and then the roads, Abuja Kaduna roads. Nothing has really happened in town. We thank God. Like, nothing, I don't think anything has even ever happened in town. That's the thing. I feel like sometimes when people think, when, when people hear that, oh, they are fighting in Kaduna or a certain state, they think it's like everywhere. But then like, which I just thank God that it hasn't gotten to like us in town. That's like the main city of Kaduna and i pray it never gets to that i just pray nigeria gets better honestly because we're not even going to talk about the problems of this country today because we're not going to finish this vlog so let's just focus on the person it's not the whole of yesterday deep cleaning because i left my room for four weeks i closed all windows cleaned everywhere and when i got back it was as if i left all my windows open i don't even know how dust does it but dust got into <laughs> my room and I had to like deep clean yesterday. I wasn't even trying to vlog because everywhere was dusty. I just needed to clean everywhere and I did that. So we have a couple of packages that I want to unbox with you guys. I did most of the unboxing on mostly on Snapchat though. The first perfumes I bought are the Huda Beauty Keali actually Keali perfumes. So I got three Keali perfumes. It came in this box. Okay, let me tell you guys something. <laughs> When I place this order, I know that most of the times I've ordered from Huda Beauty, I always have to pay customs. And this time around, I was placing an order for over $300, 390 something dollars, right? I can't even remember, but it was over $300. So I was trying to like ship it to my friend in Dubai, and then she would ship it to me in Nigeria. She would cargo it to me in Nigeria. That way it's cheaper. I would even spend like up to 10k. But then, and it was free shipping, because over $100, you get free shipping. And then I didn't even know when the page refreshed and it went back to my normal address. <laughs> Guys, they sent it to Nigeria. I didn't even know. So basically, I had to pay customs and customs was like 45,000 naira. But it was so annoying, but whatever. I just want you guys to know. So in case you want to order from them, and I think if you're urging anything over $100, you're going to have customs fee. And mine was like 45k, so... First thing I got is the very vanilla set and they were having like this bundle that you get like two That's this full sized one and and then a small This 10 ml so you get you basically get this for free in this set So this perfume, you know what? I'm going to film a haul and I'm going to give you guys a review But then long story short, I thought this was going to be my favorite and this is actually my least favorite among the three of them I actually thought like I was going to reach out for this one the most but this is actually my least favorite So this is a very good deal. You save I think $25. You really get the second one for free and then we have Amber 28 This comes in like a gold bottle. This is such a beautiful bottle mm, this is i don't even know which is my favorite between these two they were all blind buys by the way and then the last one is pink vanilla i'm sorry the last one is pink pepper sweet diamond mm, see ya yeah. This is like so hard, but then this, I, I love this too. I really, really love them. 
and i know i'm going to be reaching out for them quite often amber scents are my favorite the next um, perfume i got is i got this one the pronunciation is just a lot for me it's in french it's by Givenchy and yeah this is currently one of my favorite perfumes mm, it's currently one of my favorite perfumes that i'm using now it is so good you guys should just look out for that review i've always been a perfume lover like ever since before i went to uni ever since secondary school that was when my love for perfume started but then i've never really been into like notes i've never really studied the notes like no i'm smelling no yeah, I've never really been into that. It was just recently I started like checking the notes and I noticed that there's a particular kind of scent I like. What are those called? I found out they're called amber scents. Like any perfume that has anything amber in it, just know I'm going to get it. I know I love lavender too. I love lychee. Um, I'm a fan of floral scents and I know I'm not a fan of fruity scents. But there are some fruity scents that I'm so in love with. It's, it's confusing, Sha. But yeah, I started knowing about those recently. Then I got Twilly. Hmm. And this is like the least favorite scent that I got among all my recent purchases. But it's not it's not bad. <laughs> it's not bad, but it's just it's just not my favorite. It's just not my favorite here. Yeah. Most of my perfumes are from Essenza, guys. Like Essenza, you guys need to come and sponsor me because I have like ten of your paper bags. <laughs> Gerjoff Herba Pura. So let me tell you guys a story about this. This has always been on my wish list because I have certain perfumes that are on my wish list, and this has always been on my wish list. This perfume is so expensive, <laughs> guys. It's, it's so expensive. It was a blind buy first impressions when I, I literally opened it I have an unboxing of it so it wasn't open or anything that unboxing is on my TikTok but look this I saw this happened it was like the perfume was leaking or something happened I don't know what happened but when I checked the juice the juice is still full I, I put light like behind the bottle here just to see how full it is that's a tip to see how full your perfumes are for dark bottle from reviews that i watched i feel like nobody really got the good a very good explanation of this at least the reviews that i watched it's very it's a very fruity scent i can smell citrus in it top notes i haven't i haven't um i haven't taken note of what it smells like when it dries down but regardless i feel like i love it i, I really really like it regardless it's just that it wasn't what i expected i from like reviews that i watched um it's very different i haven't smelled anything like it yet <laughs> i haven't smelled anything like it it's very different but it's really good too. funny enough i think i have a perfume that smells something like this i'll leave a picture here Roat a la mosque or something like that <laughs> and then finally this one this one literally just came like 30 minutes ago this is Bigol by omar goddess so you guys i already have her passion and seduction and immediately this one launched i ordered it <laughs> like i didn't even waste time immediately she announced um that it was launching that's like the pre-order i'm opening it her perfumes are always a hit among the two she has made there's no bad one oh look at this bottle girl look at this bottle now ah so she said it's an amber scent and i can't wait to smell it yeah i won't put anything here first of all look at this atomizer okay i'm so sorry i had to cut short my last the last clip you guys saw before this my camera died so hi today's the next day my nails yesterday i did a bit they're quite long not so long but they're quite long this is probably very long to some people but yeah yeah i know you guys i know you have questions you're seeing me with airpods guys i got some airpods i got them yesterday it was a gift so i didn't buy it i told you people i'm never buying airpods with my money again so yeah, I got them yesterday. I've been listening to Young John's album. Young John is officially my best artist. I don't care who has been here before him, who's been doing it before him. I don't care. That's anybody's business. But yeah, 
you guys. So this is what I've been doing today. I have been just straight. I straightened my wigs. I did this bob wig. I did this bob wig. I did this my other bob wig, and then I did my straight hair. Look at this. Yeah. So I did the three of them. I'm going to do for the curly one next. I'm not straightening this one. I'm just going to curl it. Um, I got this new curler and I want to try it out. I use this new hot comb and flat iron. This, this is a hot comb. Yeah, this is what it looks like. This is what I use for my wigs today. One thing I love about it is that it gets hot so fast. And then I got this flat iron too. Cloud 9. I don't know. I believe you can get it in different places. But then I got it from the wig space in Joss. But she delivers worldwide. Yeah. I'll be nationwide. I don't know about worldwide. But I believe she delivers worldwide. Sure. But yeah, that's why I got it. This is the new curling one that I got. Yeah. You guys should ignore <laughs> where these things are. I haven't been doing anything interesting. I finally finished watching um, Young, Famous and African. I have so many things to say about that. But I didn't really enjoy it, let me not lie. But I watched it till the end. I feel like because I didn't really have anything else to watch. First of all, there are wigs and like as, as the episodes were going. But in the beginning, you guys should support my jewelry business. I sold out so fast. Thank you to those that bought from me and supported. But then we have now restocked. We have new pieces even. Look at this neck piece. Let me show you guys. This is what it looks like. This is the neck piece. This is, you just fix it like this. Oop. Yeah, this is new. This is a new one. And this is 15,000 Naira. It's very good quality. Look at it. They are electroplated to look like real gold. This is one of the new items. There are several other new items. This one is, I think this is the 22 inches here. Maybe 20 inches, I don't know. If you want it shorter, you can get shorter. Um, there's one that is like this. Shy depends on like your neck size. Yeah, there's there are shorter ones. This will look so good with like a button down shirt. At least the shorter version, the shorter one, if you don't want it too long. Yeah. So this thing is heavy. <laughs> it's heavy but it's worth it. Like this shiny. This is unisex female jewelry I did for people. I've already sent them to them. But I posted, yeah, I think I I haven't posted, but I'm going to post some on my page. Yes, but this is what Kiola looks like. Yeah, this is Kiola. So, this is what it's going to look like. And then there's a ring that says Kiola too. Yeah, this is it. I'm sorry you can't see. Just check my page. You're going to see them. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Looking for you for them. Hi guys, what's good? I can't even see the screen because of how much light is in my eye. I just finished filming now. I think I look fine. I don't think. I know I look fine. I look fine, yes. I just filming, finished filming for this week. This is a youth part week, guys. I know you thought it was my real hair, but it's not my hair. <laughs> it's a youth part week. It's detachable. By now, you people should have seen this video before this vlog goes up. So I spent my day yesterday revamping my wigs. Can you see them? Yeah, I revamped my wigs and for like two of them here I didn't revamp because they are new. And then this one I haven't revamped yet. <laughs> Let me show you guys. So this one I haven't revamped it yet. It's just on the mannequin. This one I revamped it, but then I wore it the day before yesterday. This one revamped. This one is new. I've never worn it before. It's so beautiful. I've never had a wig this color before it's really fine and then this one revamped um is a frontal wig is a frontal wig i revamped it then this one is my bone straight <laughs> so yeah this is it this i don't i don't like long hair again you guys like long hair is just a lot i think i've told you guys before but then i still love this wig very much that's why i have like very few long wigs then i have this one this is like a shoulder length wig is the front is new i've never worn it and then i have my bob and then i have this hair can you guys see the color of this hair so this is my um loose wave wig it's a frontal wig i changed the color so let me tell you guys if you want to get a chestnut brown 
color wig like this um all you need to do is just soak this hair with developer soak whatever hair it is with developer you guys know what developer is like what they mix with bleach so just soak the hair in developer um ideally you should stay for 24 hours but mine stayed for five days because the developer i used was i think it was very low like 10 percent is it 10 volume developer or something? It was very low, Sha. But then if you're using like 40 um, volume or 40% developer, it should last like 24 hours. If you're using 32, I think 32 should be like 24 hours. But then I used 10 and I really wanted the color to like come out very well. No bleach, nothing. That's all you need. Just soak the hair. And then you tie it in a nylon bag. After you tie it in a nylon bag, then wrap it inside like a dark cloth whatever dark black bed sheets whatever put it in a warm place in between your clothes or something and leave it there for 24 hours let it not me my room always has ac <laughs> so i put it inside my clothes so yeah i'm done rambling so that's how i got that color hair so i just want to check in on you guys i haven't been vlogging because my life has been boring as fuck <laughs> and i've been having exams too so yeah <laughs> You say all the right things when I'm hurting You always pick me up when I am down It's like you have a spark that leaves me burning You just have your ways to get me high You make all my dreams Hi, what's good? So I didn't start vlogging early because I wasn't even sure what I was doing. So basically, I'm in Kano. I'm so excited. This is like my second time here. But this is practically my first time here, if I'm going to be honest. Because last time I came here, I came with my mom. She came to buy some stuff in the market. So I was basically in the car. We didn't even enter Kano City, you get? So yeah, this is like my first time here. I just needed somewhere to go and Kano came up and it's closed. It's cheap too. <laughs> yeah, so I just got to my hotel. This is where I'm staying. They are still like setting up the room, so I'll show you guys when I'm back. Yeah, I'm going to I'm going to the mall now. What's your girl is doing? I'm on the line, of the day I'm doing 
doing a bit of unboxing today because i got a new fridge first of all i was looking forward to wear when i was going out i found that i had my room messy then i came back and like, unboxed my fridge and then let me not talk too much look at all these things on the that's the fridge yeah and then this is this is a stabilizer that i bought for it and then i bought this chair too yeah i was discouraged from buying this chair because i heard it's very uncomfortable but that's what i need i think i need something uncomfortable i actually sat on it before i bought it i need something uncomfortable so that i can actually work i bought it to um use to edit my videos i have my table there so yeah that's what i'm doing i look fine now Abby. my skin is clearing right it's just this neck hyperpigmentation don't worry we're working on it so you guys are just going to watch me set it up I just finished setting up my fridge <laughs> and the stabilizer is there it's, I removed there were so many like protections inside yeah oops and this is what it's looking like right now it's empty I'm just going to come and clean it because there's a bit of dust yeah there's still so much like protection here protection film Blah, blah, blah. So that's it. I know some of you are wondering, like, why did you buy a fridge? Guys, I literally live in like a different part of my house. <laughs> Not a different part, literally, but then, yeah, I'm upstairs. My room is upstairs, and, and it's, it's stressful going down every time you need something from the fridge or anytime you want to put something in the fridge. Yeah. So I just got my fridge and I'm putting my stuff here. Yeah. So that's it hi guys what's good what's happening what's popping how are you guys doing what's happening i think this is actually a good angle for vlogging this is my my work table let me tell you for something for the longest time let me say like six months now i've been feeling like youtube is not for me <laughs> it's not even a joke i'm laughing now but it's not funny like every time i i come back to be consistent there's always a force working against me you know how they say if you want something to work you like make it work no matter what i've been trying i've really been trying guys i'm not even joking and then today is april what 20th by the way i've been trying to like edit all my videos and put them out that's like videos from like the past and all of that because you guys know for the past like few months i've been doing this thing that i'll put like a whole month's vlog in one yeah so that's what i'm trying to do i have so much content fi content filmed when it comes day i was about to start editing and my hard drive won't work and my memory card adapter won't work the hard drive has been for a while now like it hasn't been working for a while and i took i took it for them to format it but i think they did it like windows but then mine is mac something sharp and then for this one this one has been showing me signs over i refuse to change it i, I will go and change it tomorrow like if any even one more thing comes up guys i'm quitting youtube <laughs> i'm not even joking because like i feel like i don't know why i can't explain it i feel like it's just people that are close to me that have complained about this thing like there's always something there's always something i promise you guys like i'm not even lazy i'm not even not trying there's just always something coming against my yeah. these are my blue light glasses yeah i've had these glasses for oh it's almost a year now i got them last year me and they've been doing me so well today what did i do today my friend came over so he just spent the whole day here with me we were just just in we went out to buy food got back we drove around small and then he left i got how my day was Anyway, I'm home alone once again as usual. <laughs> Guys, I live alone. <laughs> I've just come to accept that I live alone. Yeah. I think I should just go. I'm going to go and watch a movie now. Not a movie. Let me go and finish 
um what they call this thing the momentum no momentum ultimatum here let me play Ra, 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 ra. Uh, re, eh, eh. Re, eh, eh. yeah. 